Hello IG Garage family. Is your car showing a P0083 code? If your engine is losing power, consuming more fuel, or running rough, this issue might be the cause. Ignoring it can lead to serious performance problems. In this video, we'll cover what P0083 means, the exact sensor location, very important, and how to diagnose and fix it properly. Let's dive in. The P0083 code stands for Exhaust Valve Control Solenoid Circuit High, Bank 2. This means that the variable valve timing solenoid for the exhaust camshaft on Bank 2 is receiving too much voltage, which can affect the exhaust flow and overall engine efficiency. Symptoms of P0083 include check engine light on, poor acceleration or sluggish performance, rough idling or engine hesitation, increased fuel consumption. Common causes of P0083 are faulty VVT solenoid, it might be stuck in an open or high position, wiring issues, shorted or corroded wires causing excessive voltage, bad ECU or relay, the control module may be sending incorrect signals, dirty or contaminated oil, sludge buildup can block oil flow to the VVT system. Where is the exhaust VVT solenoid located for P0083? The VVT solenoid for the exhaust camshaft bank 2 is typically located on the side or top of the engine, near the valve cover. On V6 and V8 engines, bank 2 is usually on the passenger side. The solenoid is connected to the ECU via an electrical connector. Look for the wiring harness near the exhaust camshaft and check for any loose or damaged wires. In certain vehicles the solenoid may be positioned under the timing cover or near the front of the engine. If your car has dual VVT solenoids, make sure you're checking the one for Bank 2 exhaust. And here's a tip. Always double-check your vehicle's service manual for exact sensor placement. First inspect the engine oil. Make sure the oil is clean and at the correct level. You see, dirty oil can clog the VVT solenoid leading to failure. Now inspect the engine oil. Ensure the oil is clean and at the correct level. Dirty oil? Well, it can clog the VVT solenoid, leading to failure. Next, check the wiring and connectors. Look for broken, corroded, or shorted wires leading to the VVT solenoid. You should repair or replace any damaged wiring. All right, next up, let's test the VVT solenoid with a multimeter. First, you'll need to disconnect the solenoid and measure the resistance. If the reading is too high, well, the solenoid may be defective. Now, if the solenoid is faulty, it's time to replace it. Carefully remove the old solenoid and install the new one. Make sure the wiring is properly connected to ensure everything works smoothly. All right, so next up, clear the code and take it for a test drive. Use an OBD2 scanner to reset the P0083 code, then drive the car and check if the issue is resolved. And that's everything you need to know about P0083. Exhaust Valve Control Solenoid Circuit High Bank 2. If your car is struggling with acceleration, consuming more fuel, or running rough, make sure to check the VVT solenoid and wiring near the exhaust camshaft on Bank 2. For more car fix guides, watch these videos next. P0463, Fuel Level Sensor Circuit High Input, and P0090 Fuel Pressure Regulator Control Circuit Open. If this video helped you, like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more expert fixes from IG Garage. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.